Well, hello there, gang. It is your boy, Masterful27 here, and I'm going to take you on a little journey. Because we all know that Pokemon Go, well, actually, Pokemon started in... There, Kanto. There we go, red and blue. But in Pokemon Go, Kanto was the first generation, as in all the games, for us to hunt down and find ourselves a favourite Pokemon in the wild upon the release of the game. It should, in theory, have been the easiest dex to complete, with it being the oldest in Pokemon. Uh, I'm only kidding, I'm being cryptic here. Yes, your boy here has completed his Kanto Pokedex. You can see it there. All of them very much in place, looking all prim and proper. I wasn't going to disappoint you all then, was I? That would have looked a little bit crazy there. However, the next bit is a little bit more special. And I will explain more after I play previous me, going back to Kanto Talk, catching the first Pokemon in this family within the Kanto decks. But not the normal Kanto decks, a special Kanto deck. So we're going to go back in time where I look a lot younger. Yeah, I did look younger then, but I don't think I look too bad now. That'd be kind, please. And then we're going to go back to me now, and I'm going to show you what we're going to do and what we're going to complete on this fun little adventure. Yes. Finally, the one which has increased for the green ticket is finally coming. Shiny Bell Sprout on the incense. Oh my days, this is the one. I know I've said that again. This was the one that I wanted for me. Like, this is why I picked green, was for the Shiny Bell Sprout. As soon as I clicked on that one, and there haven't been loads of them on the incense, because obviously there's other ones there, but we've got it. We have got Shiny Bell Sprout. The shinies keep going. We're by the canal. I don't know. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say it's the canal that that's doing it, but it certainly suggests that we hit a rich trailer for form, I should say. It's either is absolutely awful. Does not matter. Shiny Bell Sprout was the one that we wanted from this event. Well, yes, yes, yes. We're gonna complete the Kanto Shiny Pokedex because, as you saw in that clip. I got my first shiny bell sprout, which was actually the featured Pokemon on the ticket. I want to say it was green, actually. I think it was green. I might be wrong. If I am, correct me. But yes, I want to finish that family line off because as you can see on my shiny decks here, as I scroll down, number 70 and 71 have remained empty. Yeah, everyone else is all there. I'll use that word again, prim and proper. We did complete the final trade, me and my boy Ash, very, very recently, which gave me the third shiny bell sprout. Now, I know some of you will be saying, hey, you don't need to get all of them. You could have evolved that one and completed it a lot earlier. Well, no, I like to have them all in there. And yeah, I just something about me, I like to have one of each evolution to complete it properly. And this was the final family. So we're going to do it now. And we're going to look at the best one. And we're, that's the one we're going to evolve fully. And then... I'll half evolve the other one to the middle stage one. So I've still got them all in there. Hundo one there. The one I actually got back then on the 20th of February 21 was awful. And that one is going to stay the Bell Sprout. However, I think we're going to go for this one. This is the one that we're going to fully evolve. And then that will enable us to complete this shiny Kanto Dex in Pokemon Go, which is something I probably held off a little bit too long but like I said I got the final one from Ash thank you for that to facilitate this and allow me to do it so there we go that is Weeping Bell that'll be number 70 ticked off now on the shiny Pokedex and I'm very happy that we've managed to do that but we're going to jump straight into we're going to fully evolve this one right now and this will complete 151 positions in the Kanto shiny Dex. Yeah, I've still got to do a lot of work on the Lucky Dex, unfortunately. But there we go. I think I need to trade a little bit more to have a chance at doing that one. But there it is, Victory Bell. A brand new shiny for this trainer here. And that allows us to do it. So we will come out of there and we will go into the Pokedex. Oh, that's not the Pokedex. That is the Pokedex. And Kanto, shiny. And there we go. All of them there. And that feels Good. There they are, now in their little places in the shiny Kanto decks. All of them completed, and that is something I can tick off. And now I've got plenty of other things I need to be focusing on. So let me know in the comments below, have you completed your shiny Kanto Pokedex in Pokemon Go? 
Or am I the last person to have done that in the world? I, I don't think that'll be the case. But please share your achievements and things that you've done really well in the game very, very recently. I'm obviously happy with this one of my own. Thank you for your support on the channel. We hit over 7,000 subscribers, which is truly amazing. I am so humbled. Thank you all so very much. And thanks to my Patreon members who take your support to the next level. That, again, is another way of saying thank you to me. And I really do appreciate it. And my way of saying thank you back to you is by having your name in the credits and getting some nice little bits and keeping engaged with you all on this journey. Thank you all so very much. Right, we'll see you on the next one. Chancy Community Day this weekend. I think we're going to have a challenge again for that one. Right, see you soon, gang.